we doing these together or separate? Ah, it's just separate. Okay. Do you want to do flare? Yeah. Or do you want to do stone cold? I'll do flare. Okay. Okay. How's it going, everybody? My name's Ryan Welch. I'm with Triple Woo! J. John Jefferson Jr., a.k.a. the natural one. Woo! Um, what are you wearing? What kind of shoes? Um, all naturals. Alligator. Alligator shoes. Can't all, hold these alligators down? All natural alligator shoes. No, that's not what it is. That's what I'm saying. My word. I can't say what he says. Okay. That's copyright infringement. I gotta do as the natural one. My goodness. Triple J he, over here. Okay, look. We're opening oh. up Ultimate Ric Flair. Alright, if you haven't got the hint, that's the hint. Okay, <laughs> look. He is, he loves the fans. He loves when people are quoting his his quotes. Like, we can see it. Can't keep these alligators down. You just said it, so I don't have to. Okay, fine. I guess I'll get sued. Um, <laughs> another, this is the new wave of Ultimates that came, uh, that's coming out basically now. Um, they should be hitting stores very soon. Or if you order from Ringside Collectibles, they should be coming through there or some of the other outlets. Yeah. Um, they actually came pretty quick from Ringside faster. Than, I yeah. actually forgot I had these, and they just showed up, and I was like, yay, yay. They're and good. I was like, Woo! Yeah, these are definitely these are definitely ones that yeah that that you'll want. Um, Ric Flair ha is an icon. Um, styling, profiling, limousine riding, jet flying, kiss stealing, wheeling, dealing, son of a gun. Anyway. Um, oh, it says on the back, he's every woman's dream and every man's nightmare. Oh, you gotta love it. Um, <laughs> I want so, that confidence. That's right. We have opened up a Macho Man Ultimate um, earlier this month. If you haven't checked checked out that video, go ahead and do so. We've also um, done The Fiend, so yeah. we've got a couple Ultimates in our queue. I'm hoping this keeps in with the same line. The articulation's good. You can pose them in all kinds of ways. I mean, really, the pose we want is is you know him going through on on the oh yeah on the ring going oh yeah you know doing his little stutter step. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. That that's all we need. Um, and also the quality of the jacket. That one is very very important. So. Without further ado, shall we open it? Woo! See, I was gonna hold back and I didn't want to take all the woos, but he did it's it. My so, turn. Thank it's my turn. Woo! Good old Ric Flair. Woo! Um, yeah, we'll do a we'll do a giveaway. Just count how many times we yell woo! No, I'm kidding. Um, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. We're, we are gonna do a giveaway at some point. We'll have a video about that up here in the near future. But um, no, Ric Flair. Styling, profiling, limousine riding, jet flying, kiss stealing, will and dealing, son of a gun. Woo! Um, okay, we'll get wooed out in a minute. We are about to. Um, classic ultimate packaging where you have information about the wrestler on the back, his finisher, um, a picture of the of the character, or at least the action figure in a pose, along with an actual picture of the wrestler. Um, this Ric Flair obviously is uh, when he was a, li a bit younger. Okay. Um, Look at that hair, though. Yeah, yeah. Well, when you when you see him in WCW, um, you know, shorter hair, a little older. Mm -hmm. um, you know, he he. I, I think a lot of people don't realize in the territories he was. A big deal. Oh, I mean, yeah. he, he's a big deal in WWE and in WCW. But um, in the territories, man, he had some amazing matches. He wrestled for a very long time. Um, too long? I mean, you can argue. We can make an argue. But um, but he could still perform. Well, yeah, and you saw that last his last match with John Michaels. Oh, Ooh, yeah. The storytelling involved with oh, that. My the, goodness. The 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 lipped. I'm sorry. I love I'm you. I'm sorry. I love you. And then switch in music. Bam. Oh. Um, just whoo. so good. I, I love how emotional that moment was, and then Shawn Michaels wins, and then you hear the. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> I'm just like, okay, maybe don't play his theme song right now. Right. Uh, <laughs> it does not match up. Um, <laughs> does not compute. No, it does not compute. Okay, all right. Open that up. Here we go. Dun Oh, did I miss some tape? Probably. Dun 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 dun. Oh no, it's like glued up here. Oh, that's weird. Nope, I missed some tape. Oh, you did. Um. Oh, and there's a quote at the very top. Do you see that? Oh. To be the man, you've got to beat the man. Look at that. That's awesome. That's a little extra detail. Did that? Did was there? A, oh, <laughs> in the bottom quote. Was there a quote on Macho Man? I don't remember. Uh, I don't remember seeing one. 
Um, you know, I see him in the box, so I'm or in the garbage. I'm about to find the, the box and look. Um, WCW belt there. While he's looking at that, I'm just going to go over the figure real quick. There you go. So joys of being a tag team is one can do one thing while the other does something else. One can be really easily distracted. Um, yes. <laughs> Macho Man has a quote. Let me in. Oh, no, this is Fiend. Sorry. No wonder. I'm like, I don't remember Macho Man saying that. <laughs> I'm um, just switching his head real quick, guys. Sorry. Let, so, yeah. Ma the Fiend had let me in and yowie wowie. <laughs> um, which, sure, why not? Um, I don't see Macho Man. I don't think you have his... I probably don't have it anymore. Packaging out. Sorry. Nah, it's okay. I'll open up mine. I'll help to find out. Um, but... Anyway, that's I, I didn't even realize that when we opened it up. That's pretty awesome. Learn um, something new. See, you learn and grow. That's right. How's the articulation? So, as per usual with the Ultimate Figures, good articulation there. You don't need much room with the ankles, because Ric Flair is not very agile. Ab joints. I put the Wu face on, but I'm not sure that I want him posing with that face now, because it just kind of looks creepy. Could you imagine that on my shelf? I mean... <laughs> <laughs> Julie's gonna walk in and be like, uh, uh -huh. well, what, what's going on? Uh, well, I think if we, I don't know. I don't even think any of the extra hands could help. Nope. Symbolize that. So we'll keep that. There you go. What's wrong with that? Look at that. Like that photorealistic face there. That's, that looks like Rick to me. Oh, yeah. I think, you know, what's interesting with wrestling figures is, you know, majority of the wrestlers are shirtless, right? Mm hmm. And so, Ooh. with the ab crunch, that's always. It kind of looks a little awkward, um, just having a big old gap in line there <laughs> in, the, in the chest. Um, but yeah, get the robe on. Mm. How do you choose which robe to give him? Right? He's had so many. He has so many. Um, I mean, this it's the pink works. The pink rocks. It's beautiful. Um, I think it would have been interesting if they had a couple, like, chase editions where you had different... Um, a different robe. <laughs> right, you know different I mean? variations of yep. the flare robe. That's right. Well, you know, if you get him and Charlotte, then they can just alternate. They can alternate, yep, that's true. Let's see if I can tie... I, mean, I think, arguably, Charlotte's is a little more um, elaborate. I think. At least her ultimate figure. Yes. Nature boy. Good old Nature. Yeah, you gotta keep the you gotta keep the robe on. How do you not? Look at that. Woo! <laughs> and I did briefly show you guys, but he does come with the classic WCW belt. I miss this belt just for its simplicity. Yeah. And just the you know the red on the sides. I always wanted this one when I was growing up. I, mean, I never got it. I mean, we can probably find it somewhere. Mm, I mean, I've got enough belts. It'll cost a couple bucks, I'm sure. I mean. Um, <laughs> So overall, just another great addition to the Ultimate line. Um, it's been a long time coming. You know, mm -hmm. Rick, like, it, it just it makes sense. Absolutely makes sense that you have him in the collection. Um, and I just love, I love the robe. Oh my goodness, the robe is so awesome. Um, like we mentioned in the intro, he should be available at stores very soon. I'd say um, so. You know, the, the, at Ringside Collectibles, that's where John ordered this guy. Um, and it just got, it arrived, what, this week? Mm -hmm. Something like that. Um, so it, you should be seeing it in short in, on store shelves. Um, I don't know. I haven't decided. I kind of want them. I'm not going to lie. I have Rogue Toys credit. Maybe I can <laughs> put it towards that. There you go. Um, if you like this video, please hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. Uh, share with your friends, and we hopefully will get some more um, regular. We, we hope to get some more Ultimates, you know, soon rather than later. Mm -hmm. um, they're awesome. I love them. Um, thank you so much for watching, everybody. We'll see you next time. Can I, can I do it one more time? Of course you can. Good job. <laughs> <laughs>